I have never seen in my 62 years of being in the Commonwealth of the Bahamas so much blatant, blatant corruption from the chief of police who happened to be in this time Will Hart that Kai Mills who has happened to be the president of the Abaco Taxi Association who happened to be an elected member of the Dundas Town Town Committee can go and report a serious crime of money laundering to the Chief of Police, Will Hart. And Will Hart, words to me, was like a school teacher scraping her uh, nails on the blackboard in high school. That the Chief of Police, Will Hart, told me that he loved, I quote, I love the man that you're reporting. Can you work it out? I say, wow. Will Hart went as far as to how Corporal role to investigate Kai Mills. Kai Mills ended up before the courts, spent the month of December in jail because I went and reported a serious crime of money laundering. And the Royal Bank also should be doing an investigation because the video I said that Royal Bank is accepting the money that is being laundered by members of the Dundas Town Town Committee in the Royal Bank. And the people who are doing the money laundering, they went and had a sworn statement taken by Corporal Roll to agree with what Kai Mills was telling Will Hart that they are indeed money laundering through the Royal Bank of Canada, which happened to be the bank that the government used in the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. So somebody should have taken my report serious. From 2017, they're being done doing this. The Understand Town Committee has over $200,000 that goes through to do the verges, the garbage collection goes for the majority of it. But remember the years of hurricane from September 1st, 2019 to when we had the local government election. All that money disappeared. I have not been to one single meeting to suggest where that money should be spent. We know that it was not spent on garbage collection because the government took care of that. It was not spent on the cleaning up of the sides of the street. So what happened to over $400,000 after Hurricane Doreen? Don't go and report it to Will Hart because he's going to tell you he loved the man whom you're reporting. But somebody ain't going to be in love with man and they're going to take Kai Mills' report serious and they're going to investigate the Dundas Town Town Committee from September 1st to October 1st, 2019. 2024. There's some serious corruption that is still happening in my birthplace. And I'm a part of the committee. And if I don't speak out and say I don't agree and what is happening and what has happened in Dundas Town, Town Committee, I am a part of it. That is why I do the video to let the residents that voted for me to let you all know that I am not a part of the corruption that continues to happen in the Dundas Town Town Committee. And the police, Will Hart, is agreeing with the corruption that is happening in the Dundas Town Town Committee. Maybe Clayton Fernanda 
will see this video, I will finally remove Bill Hart off of our code because what he's agreeing with is corruption and there's too much corruption in Abaco to have Will Hart stay as chief of police in Abaco after Kai Mills have reported a crime of money laundering and he went to jail because he took the high road and report crime and the crime is still proceeding on the chief of police, Will Hart. Kai case. Time for Will Hart to get packing. Abaco deserves better. We need better. We ought to have better. A chief of police that we can be proud of, not one that is agreeing with somebody who is teething from the community. Kai case. That's why he's here.